reason I applied to NYU was because I was so fascinated um, with where biology and just kind of science in general was moving. And that's uh, like big data analysis, right? And I came in with more of the life sciences, microbiology background, um, but without uh, the program at NYU, I would be nowhere near where I am right now. I would have had to learn um, all of this sort of on the fly. I did actually have um, some research experience in microbiology uh, and wanted to be able to sort of translate that into um, working with the actual genomes and, and RNA and everything. Before I was doing uh, food science, like food microbiology, and uh, afterwards I have been more on the animal science side, but I am still working heavily in bioinformatics now. Um, so I look at uh, bacterial communities, um, as well as doing some uh, isolation and whole genome sequence uh, work and, and analysis. I already had the skills and, and some of the knowledge about the bacteria and how genes work and, and all of that, but it was really contextualizing it into um, being able to look at everything uh, on the computer. So it was a lot of programming, uh, a lot of um, statistics and, and some uh, mathematics looking at the uh, algorithms that go into all of the programs that we use. Um, and when I say programming, I mean, uh, we learned uh, Perl and Python and basically did that so that we are, or I am able to uh, create my own scripts to go through the, uh, genomes or, or whatever I happen to be looking at um, myself uh, while also being able to understand what I learned in the bioinformatics program has basically set me up for where I am now. I loved all, all of my classes. I loved learning about Perl and Python. I was like, that would be so cool if I could do that. And now I do. The next generation sequence analysis class uh, which is really where we got to get onto the computing cluster and uh, like learn how to run everything from start to finish. Um, I don't know, I just loved all the classes. <laughs> I definitely recommend this program to anyone who is trying to uh, get into bioinformatics. If you have, bioinformatics skills already, you can sort of further them uh, into one of the specific disciplines or um, really just try and broaden uh, what you are looking at. Um, so specifically coming from the life sciences background, again, I needed to learn some of the more computer uh, skills. I, I'm pretty, I was pretty good with computers in general, uh, but again, I didn't have any of the really the programming background or um, sort of the ideas of how things were analyzed using the computer, like using Linux. Um, and that, it really helped. I think that I've had a few people over the years uh, I've been in contact with um, that want to get more of a handle on bioinformatics and so I always recommend them to NYU because the program, the professors are great. Um, they actually take time if you need to ask them questions. Uh, I was actually never on NYU's campus. I did my entire degree um, completely remotely uh, and that was wonderful, right? Like that opportunity was was great um, because the professors still had set up time to talk to us. If we needed an individual meeting, um, there was always time during classes for questions. I never felt like I didn't have a resource 
um, to go to when when I was maybe not understanding something. Uh, and then I became that resource for some other students. So I think that the way that the NYU bioinformatics program is structured is very much focused on like student success. Um, and that is a wonderful thing. It was the best experience I've had as far as schooling goes. And let me tell you, I've been in school for a long time.